It's National Bullying Prevention Month, and today we're checking in with a New Jersey woman who has made it her mission to end bullying. Yeah, we first introduced you to Shira Blumenthal this time last year. She's the founder of Hat Not Hate, which weaves her love of knitting and crocheting with her passion to prevent bullying. The idea is to get people to create blue hats, donate them to the cause, and then distribute them to schools all across the country, empowering students to stand up to bullying. So joining us once again, Shira Blumenthal. So Shira, welcome back. Thanks for being here. Uh, thank you so much for having me. You know, we thought this was so important. We wanted to talk about this. How has the campaign grown, really, within the last year since we spoke to you? Ooh, man, <laughs> you know, it's crazy because, you know, you for a minute there, I thought during the pandemic, everyone was home. So I had them. I had them captivated. And I, I said, you know, you all can make these hats. And we got, in 2020, 32,531 hats. Wow. So that was an amazing feat that we did. And unfortunately, because of the pandemic, we couldn't, we couldn't distribute the hats, which was hard, but now in 2021, we have been able to send out with the 2021 total of 32,716 wow, hats. That was when I hit 50,000. Wow. Now we hit, wow. so our total for 2020 and 2021 is 65,247 hats. And these hats have come from all over the world, all over the country, and all of these people have taken, I call them my blue soldiers, they Aww. have taken time to stitch their hearts and kindness into these hats to inspire and let kids out there know they're seen and they're heard right. and they're not alone. I love your enthusiasm. Can you just, I'm, I'm brand new to this, so I wasn't here a year ago. Can you talk about these blue hats and why did you pick blue hats specifically to be the symbol of anti-bullying? Sure. So I actually started out working at the Lion Brand Yarn store in New York City and where I then became the brand ambassador. But as a studio associate, I started teaching kids how to knit and I knit and crochet. And I saw that hats could be as simple as a square and seaming it up and being super simple or being super complex as intarsia or fair isle and making them some of the hats that we get donated are stunning and blue blue is because blue is the anti-bullying color mm -hmm. so now what's amazing is is we have there are 65,000 hats out there that are all different but they are all blue just like each and every one of those kids yeah yeah it's so so impressive what you do you're also by the way hosting a virtual assembly this week so what are people what can people expect from that uh that virtual session yeah so on the lion brand yarn facebook page since march 2020 since the pandemic started i started a show called the she show and on that <laughs> show every day at 12 p.m eastern standard time i have brought in different people from all walks of life and hat not paid has become a very important factor of that and tomorrow we are hosting Jane Clementi of the Tyler Clementi Foundation. She's coming on. Some students from Pennsylvania, middle school students are coming on. And also the actor Reed Miller, the star of the movie Joe Bell, is he did a pre-recorded interview with me talking about Hat Not Hate and talking about what the message of anti-bullying means to him. So if you're interested to tune in and to see how these hats are making a difference, and how I'm just trying to keep that conversation going yeah. and it would never be a rite of passage. Sherry, you're awesome. What you're doing is awesome. So we have to ask, what does the future hold for hat, not hate? Talk to, talk to us about what you want to do in the future with this. I want to get the local yarn shops involved. I want our local yarn shops and I want them to be ambassadors. I can only collect so many right. hats. <laughs> So I want them to feel the joy, and then with that, we want to collect. Uh, we want to have them collect the uh, the hats, and then we want them to distribute them to hats uh, to schools all around the country. So we are going to work with them in 2022. And my just mission is to just make this this country blue in the best way possible, yeah. and that just kind of spreads in the best way possible, and that no kid ever feels the way that I did when I was nine. Yeah. I know, Shira, more people need to be like you and yes. have your heart and your kindness and your spirit and your enthusiasm. So Shira Blumenthal, creator of Hat Not Hate Campaign, thank you for being here. Keep up the good work. Thank you.